everybody! Today we're going to be talking about brain size and fishes. So fishes have a range of different brain sizes, different kind of levels of intelligence, different levels of energy that their bodies have had to put into developing brains. And the fishes with the smallest size brains on the reef tend to be really cryptic or protected by armor. So fishes like the double scorpion, like we have for an example here, frog fishes, puffer fishes, trigger fishes, eels, they all tend to just sit on the ground wait for prey to come by and look gruff and angry and they don't have to think about much. So their brains aren't as developed as fishes that have to live up in the water column. They have complex social structures, they have to know where to hide from predators, they have to find specific foods, and so they have invested a lot of energy into building really big, really complex brains. So next time that you're on the reef, see if you can notice and try to guess, hmm, maybe this fish needed to evolve a bigger brain, or maybe this fish doesn't really need to worry about a brain because they're covered. <laughs>